Hey, what's up everyone? Saints fan back again with another episode of the Rockstar Logic and today I have two awesome announcements to tell you guys before we hop in. The first one is I'm doing a massive shark card giveaway. So if you want to know the details of that, then stick around to the end of this video. And the second thing is I want to let you guys know about this app called App Bounty. I'm sure a lot of you guys have heard of this already. It's an app that I use frequently to get shark cards to be able to give away to you guys. And I know a lot of you guys have told me you use their app to get shark cards yourself. Now, the way this actually works is to go to appbounty.net, link will be in the description, and enter the invite code SAINTSFAN with the capital S, and you will receive bonus points from the start, which will get you to your reward faster. But it's really easy to use in the app itself. There are all sorts of other apps you can download, and once you download one of the apps listed, you will receive a certain amount of credits. And once you have enough credits... You can redeem them for the shark cards or whatever else you decide to choose. The best part about this entire thing is after you download the offers and after you try out the apps to get points in App Bounty, you can delete the apps. So basically you're getting these credits for free by doing barely anything at all. It's really easy, really quick, and if you ever have a few minutes to spare, open App Bounty and download a few of the apps to build up your credits. Also, there is a tasks feature which will speed up this process of getting you that shark card. So yeah, hopefully you guys check it out and hopefully you get some free money as well. Now, hopping in to this week's episode. The first few we're gonna start with are from the new items and game modes that Rockstar put into the game. The Cheetah Classic and the freaking Overtime Rumble game mode. We're gonna start with that freaking Overtime Rumble game mode because I got a complaint, Rockstar. How do you allow people to go AFK in this game mode for so freaking long? There was a guy on my team the other day, he was AFK, he wasn't even moving, so it's not like he had a rubber band around the, the gas or something so where he's always moving. He was just freaking sitting there, and because of that, we ended up losing because it's not fair. It was like a 5v3 game which just defeats the entire purpose of the game because it has to be balanced for it to be fun. So like, what the heck? Was that not properly tested before you added the game to online? And on a less serious note, when the hell did the Ruler 2000 become a freaking sports car? Now, the freaking cheetah, wh where do the vents go? The vents are there on the freaking top? But then you open it up, and they're gone! Freaking magical vents! And then, alright, I will admit, I'm not entirely sure if this applies to all cars with the engine in the back or not. But I feel like, even in real life, if the engine's in the back, the front is still called the hood, and the back is still called the trunk. So why the hell, on the Cheetah Classic, did the freaking hood become the trunk, and the trunk become the hood? Oh, don't look at anything here, just uh, some typical license plate things. Of course, the one on the left is perfectly fine, but the one on the right is not. You know, one of you guys brought up a good point. In the technical mission, where, or in one of the supply missions where you have to go steal the technical, how in the hell did they get it up there? Did they freaking build it? Because there's just a little door, and there's no stairs or ramp to get up there. One thing, you know, that just breaks the laws of physics themselves. When you're driving, or you know what, when you're in a car and you throw a grenade, or a sticky bomb, whatever, and you're standing still, it doesn't go too far. But then, somehow, freaking magically, when you're going faster, it goes further. It should be the opposite. I guess uh, lights don't have shadows now. I guess we just gonna forget the fact that that's a real thing, huh? I mean, look, I know lights in this game are broken enough as it is, but I feel like we could at least have some shadows in the game. Why are these signs upside down? Who, who was like, you know what? Just in case anyone's upside down, we're putting the signs upside down too. And then here we have some fan submitted ones. This freaking guy is in the middle of flying when the game kicks him for being idle, for being AFK. Come on. You know, this one, <laughs> this is from one of you guys. I, I actually had to laugh at this. I know there's other ways to make money, but look at this. This guy is flat out broke. He's got zero in his bank and zero in his wallet. And they want him to freaking pay $200 to start a job. 
How the hell is he supposed to make money if he's got to pay to play jobs? And you know what? That's going to end it because the bonus clip is probably one of the greatest Rockstar Logics when it comes to the Rockstar support. So I'll let you guys, I'll, I'll end the video on that one. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Please drop the video a like if you did. Now getting into the shark card giveaway, I'm doing a massive giveaway and I'm gonna be doing it on YouTube. Instead of doing it on Twitter, I rarely ever do giveaways on YouTube just cause it's kind of complicated. But what I want you guys to do to be able to enter, all you have to do is be subscribed, number one, like the video, number two, and then number three in the comment section, link your gamer tag or your PSN ID or your PC social club. And I'll just go ahead and pick a random winner in like a day or two. And I will message you probably on either YouTube or your gamer tag on whatever console you're on. And then I'll give you the code that way. You can enter as many times as you want. I don't actually think it matters though because the program I use, I'm pretty sure it just, it picks just one person, regardless of how many times you've entered. But if you want to enter as many times as you want, then go for it in the comment section. But just in case any of that was confusing, I'll leave the rules in the description and I'll probably even leave a comment in the comment section so you know the rules. It's really simple, three things, subscribe, like the video, and then leave a comment of your gamer tag or PSN ID with obviously what console you're on just so i know but that is it now the bonus club i want to explain this guy he requested support for max Payne 3 he was having some problems on pc with max Payne 3 but freaking rockstar support can't even get that right they gave him a response about gta 5 so just enjoy his little clip <laughs> 